Hey everyone, in this video I'm going to show you how to use pick collage to cut out a picture. In this case, the picture I'm going to cut out is a picture of me. Freestyle, tap anywhere, and choose photos. And the picture that I'm going to select is a picture of me that has a background. So, this one. Just a picture I took, click on the picture, press tick, and you can see it inserts into the document. And for some reason, Pic Collage decides to go opposite when you do a recording, because it's, it's in a tool format. Anyway, so I'm going to double tap on my picture, I'm going to hit cut out, and I'm going to trace gently around the picture. Well, it doesn't have to be super close, but you've got to trace around everything you want to keep. Once you're done, what Pic Collage will do, it will try to dis distinguish the background. So along the bottom, you can see these four pictures of me. So if I click on there, you can see that that's done a pretty good job of cutting out, but it's got some of my shirt missing. This one's got too much white space around me. This one here as well. I'm going to click on the first one. What we can do with pick collage, we can get really precise by clicking on the pencil. That means to edit. Now I can add or erase. I'm going to add. I want to keep the, my button and my shirt bit. Anywhere where it's slightly pink, it will cut out. So I can pin, double pinch and zoom in to get these last little bits of my shirt along that edge using my finger to be as precise as possible making it look good double fingers to pinch to zoom out you can see on my collar here on this side here I've need to cut that out a bit more over here I've got a bit more of my shirt it's looking pretty good my hair's looking all right now up here it's got a bit of the background confused so I'm gonna get rid of some of that go in get a raise and you can zoom right in and get really close so you can be super precise if you like so you can see I'm even getting in between my hair there now you can see when I zoom right in it becomes pixelated so that's that's only just for a bit of um, editing purposes that I'm doing that. So this is what would happen if you enlarged a picture. You just made it bigger and bigger and bigger. So you don't want to be pixelating your artwork in your final. Uh, accidentally got rid of a bit of hair there. All right, once you're happy with it, you press the tick. And that looks pretty good. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm going to drag that around I'm going to fill up my screen. Now, if I was to save that to the library, what's going to happen is it's going to put a pick collage watermark over the bottom of my picture. I don't want to avoid that. I can hold down the power and the home screen and take a screenshot. And if I click on that, then I can bring it up, get rid of the watermark, and oops, just undo that. Sometimes you can draw because the screenshots are markup. Happy with that, you press done and save to photos. I now have that in my camera roll if I go to photos and I want to just have a look at that. I've got a pretty good photo cut out of me with a white background. So that's how you, you cut out a background in Pic Collage, pretty straightforward. It's an awesome little app that you can then take that picture into any other app that you would like. 